In this video, I will show you how to program the ATV320 drive to run using terminal control for two wire control and use the 4 to 20 milliamps reference speed on AI3 and common as a way of ramping up your motor or down your motor. From your main display, you want to enter and go down to configuration, enter. Now you want to enter on full and now you want to scroll down and look for CTL menu enter and like I said before you want to use your AI 3 as a means of a 0 to 20 or a 4 to 20 speed reference so the speed reference parameter is FR1 and you want to change that when you enter you want to make it AI 3 make sure you press enter to, uh, to change that effect that value and once you're back to FR1 you want to scroll down and you can choose to set your profile as separate. I mean, since the terminals and your AI3 are the same channel, it's the same terminals, it's the same channel technically. So in a way, you don't have to change your profile to separate or not separate. But if you like the same change as CHCF parameter to SCP, if not already, it wouldn't hurt it. And also make sure that when you have done that, the parameter CD1, which is your actual channel for starting and stopping is at the terminals which is what it is from the factory and one more thing I want to show you is to change the scaling of your AI3 analog input you can escape back to the CTL menu once you're done programming the command menu once you see that turn counterclockwise to IO enter and you'll have some functions in here where you can adjust your scaling so for example you can go to AI3 dash submenu within the IO menu where you can change your um, AI3 type which is your was it a milliamps is it a I mean is it a 4 to 20 is it a 0 to 20 as an example um, you can also give it a you know the low scaling as a bias which is you want a 4 milliamps as an example or I guess you want to do a 0 to 20 instead of 4 to 20 um, but regardless, you can always come into this menu, AI3 dash under IO, just to change the scaling of your analog input 3. And the IO menu, of course, is under your full menu. So if you ever are lost, just escape back to your main screen. And I want CONF, that's where most of the parameters are located. And you want to go to full. And this is where you have the I.O. menu and the control menu listed here, as you talked about. And this is how you program the ATV320 drive as a means of starting and stopping from terminal mode and using the AI3 as a means of controlling the drive 4 to 20 milliamps reference.